Hi everyone, I want to share you this fun die and it is an XL die right here. It's by Susan's Garden and let's see, let me take it out of plastic. It's called 3D Wheelbarrow and it makes this really cute and fun wheelbarrow that you can incorporate flowers in and I thought it would be fun to give as a gift. You can use, um, this is using a Prima Butterfly paper collection so it's a great when it's double sided because you will see both sides and you could fill it in with some of the coordinating flowers. I thought it would be really fun. And if you actually push it, you can see here the wheels actually does move. It's, it's really cute. So I'm going to show you how to make this. Um, basically, these are the pieces that you get. And you will need a brad to hold it together. So I have this little tiny brad. And all you have to do is just, um, this is the wheelbarrow. So you're just going to fold in the scored lines. You have two crease lines right here that you're basically going to fold. So fold that in. This paper isn't double sided so you will see the other side. So it's nicer to use double sided paper. And it makes a great favor. So just do that. Okay. Then you're going to take this piece and you're going to see it has four tabs and then it has a score line here so just follow the score lines and just fold it down and just fold in these tabs. You're going to add adhesive to the top of the tabs so I'm going to add some adhesive. And I'm using this craft glue by Helmar. And I get a set of Hobby Lobby. So you just connect it like so. It's really easy to put together. And then this is the piece that you're going to get. Okay. Then you basically just adhere to the bottom. So add adhesive to the bottom. Okay. So just add some adhesive. And then you just add it to the wheelbarrow. Like so. I line this up with this piece right here. So just line that up together. Okay, you're going to add adhesive to the sides right here. Just enough to hold it, connect it to this piece. So I just add a little bit here. And do that to both sides. And just give it a good press. And you can um, use chipboard and distress it and make it look like a really nice vintage wheelbarrow, just like it has it on the photo there. Okay, so that's all you do there. And then you're going to make the bottom piece. So you got this piece here and it has four scored lines. So all you're going to do is just fold those scored lines like so. And then you're going to add adhesive to the ends here to both sides. Just glue it down. So just line it up. Okay, 
side, so it looks like that. And then you're going to add adhesive on the top right here. And then you're going to glue that down right here to the back. And again, I just line it up with this line right here. Just center it because it is a little bit longer than this piece right here. Okay, so it's looking good. And then we just need to connect the wheels, so we're just going to adhere them together. Just like that. And then you're going to take your brad And all you're going to do is take the wheelbarrow and then just place the, it on top like that. And you can cover the brad with flowers or you don't even have to put a brad, you can adhere it. It puts pearls, small flower. There you go. That's how it is to put it together. Really easy. Again, it makes a really cute gift. And that's how you make it. Thanks for watching. Bye.